what's going on guys it's pat and welcome to season four of minecraft epic proportions and guys i have some awesome mods for this season if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe because this one is going to be epic i know it took a little bit longer than expected but i now have everything set up and that is an awesome castle over there i'm thinking that might be our home this year that looks amazing for a house I know we've seen them before, but I never actually used it for like a place to live, and I think that would be great. But today, basically what we're going to be doing is trying to get some type of shelter, whether it's like conquering an epic castle or building something really pathetic, which I seem to do every season. I'm going to try to avoid it this time. Going to try to avoid it. And I'll be talking about all the cool mods I have installed, and I've got some amazing ones. This is definitely going to be the best season so far. Um, but yeah, guys, it is going to be a mod pack once again. I'm not sure if the download is up yet or not. I'm actually just waiting on permission from one mod creator. So as the video's up, it might be up. It might not check the description. If it's not there, it will be very soon. Um, oh yeah, and the name for the mod pack, Ultimate Adventure Pack. Because this one is going to be an amazing like adventure RPG type series. Mm. Got like an apple cow right next to me. You think he drops apples? I'm going to make a weapon if I can out of this wood here. It's palm wood from Tropicraft. Cool. All right, so if I use this, what can it make? Can make this, of course, and can I make everything I normally can make? Cool, I can. That's good, because I wasn't so sure. All right, so we'll make a crafting table really quickly and try to make, like, a weapon. I need to kill the apple cow. He might drop a lot of food. I'm thinking apples. We will see. He's giving me that look like he doesn't want me to kill him, but I really have no choice, or I will starve to death. All right, so let's see. First thing we need is some sticks here. All right, that should be enough. And I think I'll go with the weapon, a pickaxe, and an axe. I think that'll be good. All right, so got my pickaxe and an axe. Okay, enough to get us started. So the thing is, we actually could go straight for that castle, but I have some really hard mods installed, and I'm pretty sure it'll just lead to our death at this point. I think we need some gear, we need some armor, some decent weapons that are better than, you know, this. A, a wood sword. It's not very strong. And there's nothing in this structure. Sorry, sheep. I need as much wool as possible because I will need a bed. If you're looking at the water and, like, think there's something wrong, it is actually the weather mod. Looks really cool, doesn't it? The water's, like, flowing because of the wind. All right, so the cool mods I have installed, like the biggest ones, I've got Ore Spawn. So many people requested it, and I really wanted it too because there's like so many awesome bosses. So there's going to be a lot of tough boss fights. No apples? No apples. I see how it is. All right, here's another sheep. I've got better dungeons again. I had to add it, guys, because they updated it. There's even more bosses, more structures. It's better than it's ever been before. Ooh, I have an idea. See the girlfriend over there? I'm going to tame her. Yeah, yeah, it sounds weird when I say it. Capture her. Does that sound better? Not really. Um, so I'm going to grab a bunch of roses so she will become my girlfriend. I'll convince her with these. Let me just get all these. Um, I also have the Lion King mod. That's another dimensional mod. I already mentioned Tropicraft as a dimensional mod and Lord of the Rings. So yeah, lots of stuff. This is going to be a long series. Hello? Would, would you like to be my girlfriend, please? Jen's not going to play with me, so I, I need to like recruit a girlfriend <laughs> from the mods. All right, I've got eight roses, so I have a lot of attempts here. Please? Thank you. Only took two. My new girlfriend, she will protect me. Um, should I give her the sword? Now nah, we'll get some better stuff. All right, let me grab this. I'm pretty sure this is for ore spawn, and it spawns the ants, which are for going to the other dimensions. So follow me. Come this way. Give me this thing. Is that a pineapple? It is. And this... Oh, it is for the pina colada. So you need the pina colada to go to the other dimension, which is kind of hilarious in itself. But, um, <laughs> lots of cool stuff around. Oh, I've got two wool. She just says she loves me. <laughs> Gonna give her a weapon in a minute. That way, any scary mobs come, she could just, like, you know, destroy them for me. And let's make sure we get enough wool. Ooh, it's one of the floating villages. This is, like, the best spawn ever. All right, there's got to be some cool stuff around. I can't go to the castle yet. It's too dangerous. But once we get some gear, I'm going over there, and I'm going to live there. I am. And one thing I always do in my series, if you're if you're new to the channel, I always have a special building called the Fanchion where I put people's names that comment. Like, I pick a, pe I pick a couple people, like, completely randomly. And I'm going to be doing that once again. So make sure to leave a comment. And since it's the first episode, guys, make sure to leave a like. Can we hit, like, 1,500 likes? That would be awesome. I'd really appreciate it. 
All right, are you ready to go? We need some better weapons. All right, so, ooh, it's one of these, like, statues. I th He's missing an eye, actually. I think he's missing a piece of wool that's supposed to be over there. I think these can have, like, a diamond in it. I'm pretty sure someone told me that. But um, last time I checked, they definitely didn't have one. But I'm going to grab some cobblestone from this so we can make some stone tools. Might as well. And if we somehow get lucky, find a diamond up there somewhere, that would be sick too. But I, I obviously don't want to spend too much time, like, you know, grabbing cobblestone. I'm thinking, like, ten pieces should be enough. Like, a butterfly is trying to kill itself. Trying to get in front of me. Don't do that. Oh, there's, like, um, little house right here. Little house. Anything in the furnaces? No. So I'll just grab these, I guess. Might as well. Free furnaces. More cobblestone I don't have to pick up. And, yeah, this is a really, really sad house. Very sad. Okay, so I'm going to put this down, and I guess I should make some stone stuff now. All right. Oh, she needs a weapon, and I need a weapon. So this is going to be a lot better. All right, got that. Let's see. What else do I need here? A pickaxe. Mine a little bit quicker. And also an axe. All right, that should be good for now, I think. Where'd she go? go off oh, there you are. Take this. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, she can actually fight. She can't wear, she can't wear um, armor, you know, but she can. Wield the sword. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Not going to go towards the battle tower thing. Is that what this is? Yeah, it definitely is. Not going to go in there too dangerous at this point. But there's a lot of structures around. And there's even the structure from last season that we used as a fanchion right there. All right. I see some, like, ore structures. I'll stop at this one over here. But I don't want to spend, like, too much time, like, you know, mining the first day. Could get a little bit boring. So I'll grab a little, though. I'm probably just going to get, like, um, the coal and the iron, like, really quickly. That way we have stuff for the furnace, and we've got um some iron for maybe some gear or something. Is she following me? There she is. That's kind of cool, though. I need a companion to help me kill stuff. We have some, like, serious bosses in this series. It's going to be rough. Oh, and good news for you guys downloading the mod pack. It should work better than last season. I know last season a lot of people had really bad world loading times because of all the mods. This season, it's still long, but it's it's a lot better. So if you have a decent computer, it should run good. Last time, you needed, like, an amazing computer. This time, I think just a decent computer. And you should be able to play this one. All right, there we go. Plenty of iron. And we need to find a home. Where'd you go? Where is she? She's, like, up there. Need to find a home right now. There's two of those structures, actually. There are so many structures around. If you use the seed, though, it doesn't mean these structures will generate... It's kind of random. It's like a worst house ever. Nothing in here at all. Try that barn over there. And yeah, this season we do have Zan's minimap instead of Ray's minimap because it wasn't updated. So yeah, a lot of different mods. I'm going to have a link down below too that says like all the mods, you know. Um, it'll be on like the mod pack download page. And there are a lot of mods installed right now. And it seems to be running really good too. No lag or anything. It's two normal ant nests. Anything in here? Second floor. Should, should we check it? Go upstairs. There's like no stairs. She's like literally going upstairs as I said. Oh my god. She listened to me. She's a genius. I didn't even know there were stairs. That was weird. Did you see that? I said go upstairs. First thing she did. Found the stairs. And she's going towards the freaking roof. That is, that is weird. That is really weird. It's freaking me out a little bit. How did you get up here? How did you know to get up here? Oh my god. All right. So yeah, the geniuses. This what a great mod. They could even understand your voice as you talk. All right. So the sun is starting to go down. I'm thinking now's the time to um to make that bed. Second floor bed seems kind of safe. And yeah, I do have the more health mod too. Um I customized it specifically for the mod pack. I definitely need some food. Let's go to sleep and then I'm going to grab food like first thing in the morning. All right, here we go. It's getting really late. I, I just grabbed the wrong wood. Come home. Come inside. It's dangerous out there. She's, like, guarding the place. Okay, so there we go. And I've got the wool. It's, like, multicolored bed right here. And we must go to sleep right now. All right. Okay, we're good. We're good. We made it. She, like, ran over to me as I went to sleep. And everything's, everything's fine. Everything is fine. Probably should set a waypoint. 
So it's M to um go into the map and waypoints right there. New waypoint. And I haven't used this before, guys. Zan's mini map is new to me. Really pathetic. It, it really is. Really pathetic house. I know. I've, I've got something. I'm gonna have to live here for a small amount of time. It's like I'm like glowing when I'm in it. All right, so I need to get food like right now. So we're leaving. We're going hunting for food. So we need some serious food, guys. Luckily, there's like animals everywhere. There's like 20 cows here. And we really need a lot of it because, you know, I'm starving. I'm gonna die if I don't eat. And I really need to get some like armor. Once I get some armor, we can try to capture the castle. And that is gonna be awesome. Look at it. It's like loading in. It's freaky. All right, that should be enough. All right, how much do I have? I've got 10 pieces of meat, and I can actually, you know, smelt these too. Cook them. And wow, does that look weird when it's not perfectly loaded. It's really scary, actually. I don't know what's up with that. Um, but I'm not going to worry about it right now. Oh, so there's some structures in this direction. And I'm hoping there's going to be some, like, weapons and armor and stuff like that in there. Let me just eat this. I think I can capture multiple girlfriends. I'm not gonna do that right away. It just seems weird. I don't want like 10 people following me around. It'd be really annoying. Don't attack her. All right, good, she just ran by. There's like some random like flying obsidian thing right here. What is this? No idea. It's a creeper face right there. We gotta check this out. So I'm pretty sure creepers spawn in here. I'm like 100% sure. Oh, a blue creeper. A lightning. Oh, God. Lightning. Kill it. Good job. She owns. That was pretty sick. But, yeah, I have the special mobs mod installed. So, like, special kinds of mobs, you know, can come out like a lightning creeper. Anything useful in here? Music discs. Redstone. Saddle. Diamond horse armor. I could use the saddle on our first animal bike, I guess. And should I just grab this? I'm going to need it. Give me this chest. And what else is around here? So, yeah, we use this for the fanchion, but it's kind of dangerous. And anything in here? No. Some more crafting tables. And what I'm going to do... I'm not going to worry about all this coal right now. I can grab some off-camera anyway. I like to do, like, the boring stuff, like, not on camera. Because how exciting is it to just grab coal? Not very exciting. There's a chest right there. I feel like I should break the spawner first. Ow, Actually... Woo, you all right? You, you okay? <laughs> all right, I'll jump down, too. I'm going to break it through this. All right, I'll get rid of that. I'll get some experience from that, too, which is always nice. And hopefully there's a lot of chests around. Got it. Awesome. And here, come on, something good. Got a heart piece. If I get, like, four of those, I think, yeah, I can make a heart container, which gives me one more heart. But right now it's customized to um, gain me every 15 levels. I'll get one more heart, and it's capped at 15. That's how I set it for this series. And for everyone that downloads the mod pack, too. I can see mobs, like, on the mini-map. Zan's mini-map freaks me out because of that. All right, does this, like, go down? I don't, I don't want to go there. I'm not ready for that. Not ready for anything too dangerous. Because we'll pretty much instantly die. Rare spawns from infernal mobs are going to kill us really easily. I'm thinking I'm going to try to grab some iron to get some um, armor off camera. Because, you know, there's, there's, like, armor. I mean, there's not armor. There's ore all over the place, like, on those, like, little mini structures. And that way, next time, we can just jump into the castle and be ready for our new home. But, yeah, just taking a look around right now, seeing what kind of structures there are. And there seems to be stuff, like, everywhere. And I'm kind of liking Zan's mini-map. I like how it shows that there's mobs. Although, it makes me extremely paranoid. Like, really paranoid. All right, let's look. Oh, this is kind of blurry in the in the big version on this one. I have no idea what this is. Like, like what could this possibly be? Maybe there's something like in the middle of it or, or something like that. But I guess we'll see. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. It really does help me out. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.